In this problem, I need to make punch where three cups of grape juice is mixed with five cups of apple juice. If I need to make 40 cups of punch, how many cups of grape juice is needed? One way to solve this problem is to set up a ratio table. I could set up a table with the amount of grape juice to the amount of apple juice. This would be my part-part ratio, and I would recognize that I need three parts grape juice for every five parts apple juice. I could also use a part-whole relationship to describe this ratio. That is, if I have three parts grape and five parts apple, the total amount of punch would be eight cups. Therefore, a part whole ratio is three parts grape to eight total cups of punch. I would now recognize that I need 40 cups of punch. Originally, if I had a mixture of three cups grape and five cups apple, I would have eight total cups. Therefore, I need five times that amount of punch. Multiplying eight by five would give me my desired 40 cups of punch. In order to keep an equivalent ratio, whether it's a part part or part whole, I would have to now multiply each of my parts by five. Therefore, if I took my amount grape and multiplied it by five, I would have 15 total cups of grape juice. Multiplying my part apple also by five, I would have a total of 25 cups apple. I would recognize that the ratio of 15 cups grape to 25 cups apple is equivalent to that ratio of 3 to 5. I also know that if I took 15 cups of grape juice and added it to 25 cups of apple juice, I would have 40 total cups of punch. Therefore, I know that I need 15 cups of grape juice. Another way that I could solve this problem is to set up a proportion. And in this proportion, I want the part grape juice to the total parts of punch. Therefore, my part whole ratio would be 3 cups grape to 8 cups punch. Again, writing the part, part, part grape to part apple as a part whole, part grape to whole punch. I know I want an equivalent ratio where I need to determine the amount of grape juice when I have 40 total cups of punch. Since these are equivalent ratios, I know that in order to get my denominator of 8 to a denominator of 40, I have to multiply by 5. To keep the equivalent ratios, I would have to also multiply my numerator by 5. This gives us the part grape is 3 times 5 which is equal to 15 total cups of grape juice.